Jeff, you're yes. introducing a new integrated amplifier. It's the buzz of the show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is the first uh, uh, U.S. Uh, premiere showing mm -hmm. of the Damon integrated. Okay. And um, we uh, actually showed it earlier this year in Munich, the big hi-fi show there. But mm -hmm. uh, this is the official U.S. launch of the integrated. And uh, it's been a long work in progress. And uh, it's... Um, uh, we call it a super integrated because it incorporates uh, so many features and uh, it's uh, certainly powerful in, in terms of uh, it will drive any speaker to any level that you would wish. Well, speaking uh, of speakers, what do we have in the system real okay. quick before we talk the, about these that? These are yeah. the uh, uh, YG Acoustic Sony, uh, Sonys okay. and uh, they're based here in Denver and they were kind to come and set up and uh, loan us the speakers for this particular show. Mm -hmm. And the entire system is wired with Nordost Odin. Tool. Yeah, I was just going to say that's Odin back there. If my yeah. uh, mm -hmm. my eyes are not fooling me, yep, yeah, there it is, on. viewers. See the Odin. Mm -hmm. I see a Bergman turntable here. Yeah, this is the Bergman. They were kind enough to uh, come and set this up, and we've been uh, very happy with its uh, phono performance at the show because uh, the nice thing about the Damon integrated, it has a phono option. Uh, that uh, converts the uh, input one to uh, either a line level uh, analog input or you can install, uh, we can install, you can order it as a with a phono option so it has a, uh, a card that uh, plugs into the uh, input one. Okay, moving down the rack here, uh, we're using the uh, Oracle uh, CD transport. Uh, we wanted to, to to show a very simple system um, for those that want to simplify their system the um, uh, all you really need for a full system with a an integrated is um, is a, a, a source a, a, yeah. a, a digital source it could be either a, a, a CD transport uh, we do have a streaming option for the daemon uh, we have uh, basically 23 inputs on it and it will take uh, uh, a number of digital inputs so uh, we're just using one and and one of the points of this show we wanted to show that that uh, Redbook uh, CD and 44.1 16-bit is still a viable option and a lot of our our uh, music libraries still exist in that form so uh, yeah I have a very large uh, uh, yeah, Redbook and, uh, and it's it's amazing uh, with the proper playback equipment what information is still can be extracted off that uh, red book format. I agree. You don't have to go right. DSD, folks. Today, no, I mean your red book. Yeah, I mean you yeah, can do yeah. great red book oh, today. It's incredible. It really is. I agree. Yeah. Yep. The um, design goal of this amp, uh, this integrated was to make a powerful platform that has. Uh, all the power that you would ever need. It's 1,500 watts per channel into 8 ohms and 2,500 into 4 ohms. Oh my goodness gracious. So, uh, wow. And it's uh, because it's in a Class D format, mm -hmm. it, uh, it does run quite cool. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, we were quite surprised with this, uh, this particular Class D platform and uh, its, its uh, delicacy and, and unlimited dynamics. So you don't really uh, appreciate large amounts of power until you until you get to experience it, it and yeah. use it. Yeah. I remember when I saw a, a, it was a show. It was Rocky Mountain many many years ago. You uh, exhibited with Magico, and there, it was the first time they publicly exhibited. You had a small amplifier. It was, a, I believe, a three oh one. Yeah, probably was. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah, and that was my first real taste of <laughs> a switching amplifier, yeah. and I couldn't believe how good it sounded. You're a master. Of these switching amplifiers. Well, yeah. it's uh, yeah, uh, Class D has uh, had time for uh, a maturity, mm -hmm. and uh, we were one of the first companies to actually uh, introduce that into mm -hmm. the into the high end mainstream. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, it's it's had time now to. Uh, it, it's not the sole platform of our because I'm still a, a Class AB analog designer. Mm -hmm. That's what I've been doing for 45 years. So, yeah, yeah. so uh, yes, but it, you know, it has its application, and especially in terms of uh, a lot of power in a in a smaller space without a lot of heat, because yep. an integrated involves, you know, uh, attention to certain uh, uh, 
field interactions because everything is in a it's tighter. So tight that like, uh, compacted. But if it's done right, uh, we were probably one of the one of the first uh, high end uh, companies to bring out the whole integrated concept mm -hmm. of, of putting amps and preamps and mm -hmm. together in one box. Well, there's a lot of designers out there that say their best work is their integrated, and I know that uh, I've had at least two top-level designers over the past 12 months tell me, mm -hmm. hey, as good as my separates are, I think my integrated sound better. Yeah. 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 And we're uh, betting that that is possibly the movement of the industry mm -hmm. in terms of the older demographic that uh, wants to simplify. Mm -hmm and the younger demographic that is expecting everything in one box. <laughs> and uh, this also has a headphone um, output oh, Look at that, look it. at that right there. And um, um, it is also unique. I, in this I wanted to kind of get away from the rotary knob, so it has a, a wheel here that, oh, uh, that. that uh, adjusts the volume. And it's one of the first products with an actual touch screen. So, um, Everything is, is uh, you can swipe, you can either s select inputs by uh, pushing or you can... Uh, I love it. Uh, actually here, I only have four inputs shown mm -hmm. uh, because you can assign an input uh, by going to the different pages here. Oh, look at that. And you can, you can uh, assign uh, inputs with, uh, you can turn them on or off in, in terms of the icon showing. Or you can uh, you can set the parameters of those inputs, um, and uh, you can name them. Here we have just uh, here we've just named like Oracle CD. Yeah. Okay. And uh, the phono would be the uh, oh uh, wait uh, let's see this is a this is a computer. a computer we have okay. a computer yeah. and mm -hmm. and here we have the, uh, the Bergman. Bergman. Um, Sindre, Sindre uh, there, yeah, table, which here. is up there. So, yeah, yours, so yeah. and you could load this up with. Uh, you can choose your icon. You can choose your name, and um, the other uh, uh, nice thing about this integrate is that we've uh, integrated a Bluetooth remote. So um, uh, actually, let me get that. A, yeah. uh, an iPod Touch. Okay. And uh, basically, it's an app. We have an app here, so you can. And this is just a, a beta tester here, so we have we can select the the, the absolute phase and the balance, and you can shut the display off or on. Here. Oh, totally cool! Uh, and uh, the volume up and down. It's a navigating, mm -hmm. uh, so you can mute here, and so this is Bluetooth, so you don't have to point. Mm -hmm. And uh, but it does also have an, an IR remote mm -hmm. too. Mm -hmm. Well, the the power is is one thing, but the the connectivity. And the ability to just pretty much connect anything. I mean, there's three Toslink inputs. There's mm -hmm. four SPDIF inputs, both mm -hmm. coax and PNC, mm -hmm. ASCBU, mm -hmm. XLR, USB, SAD mm -hmm. uh, capable, mm -hmm. and uh, through the USB. And uh, you can also uh, um, select uh, direct amp in. Oh, okay. So, uh, so you're going to bypass the. Yeah, you that. can bypass the. Uh, the preamp. The preamp just stage. Use it as a 1500 watt stereo amplifier. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, that's a dynamite uh, uh, lineup of features. I mean, I can't believe the touch screen. I mean, <laughs> yeah, was it, was, that? it was a lot of work. We that's had a number cool. of uh, engineering teams uh, in Europe, Denmark, and and uh, uh, working on uh, all the uh, the interface and mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. you know the. Um, it's nice because you can, you know, you can adjust volume just by touching and moving the. Look at the, that. Uh, um, uh, it, it was uh, it was well thought out over the course of a couple years. Well, okay. so so it's uh, it's really uh, <laughs> here it is a big work. Yeah. Yeah, here it is. Well, I want to thank you very much, Jeff okay. Rowland, yeah, for introducing the Damon to the viewers and. Uh, uh, everybody spread this video around make this video go viral because more people have got to use integrated <laughs> yeah, amplifiers yeah. from Jeff Rowland I really think that you're a well we just uh, yeah I like to have uh, you know I think the trend of uh, having everything in in one box you know you you don't have to buy a separate uh, DAC and, mm -hmm. and preamp and amplifier uh, you can actually get it all in one now so uh, with uh, you know same level of performance. There you go.
Okay, well, you've heard it here first. Okay. Thank you, Jeff, and congrats on the rollout. Okay, okay. Well, thank you. Let's do some listening. Here we go. Thank you. And one more. Perfect. get so far gone where do I belong where in the world did I ever go wrong if I took the time to replace what my mind erased I still feel as if I'm here but I'm gone porched up in a rocking chair Feet all bare, holding my blunt in the cigar Living in a lesser mind, never do take the time. Waiting for my heart, quiet as it's kept. How did I get so far gone? Do I belong? Where in the world did I ever go wrong? If I took the time to replace what my mind erased, I still feel as if I'm here but I'm gone. exacting sound and the room isn't hot because the amplifier runs cool viewers congratulations Jeff Rowland Design Group the new integrated 